फ्रेंड्स यू हैव सीन मेनी वीडियोस ऑन हाइड्रोपोनिक्स व्हिच टॉक अबाउट ग्रोइंग एक्सोटिक्स ग्रोइंग ऑफ सीजन क्रॉप्स यू वुड आल्सो हैव सीन वीडियोस फ्रॉम आवर साइड व्हिच आल्सो एक्सप्लेन अबाउट दैट बट इज इट दैट हाइड्रोपोनिक्स कैन ओनली मेक मनी इफ यू आर ग्रोइंग एक्सोटिक्स इन वेरी हाई कॉस्ट हाईली क्लाइमेट कंट्रोल्ड हाईली ऑटोमेटेड स्ट्रक्चर्स और इज इट आल्सो पॉसिबल टू डू अ लो कॉस्ट सेटअप grow a produce which is a local produce sell it in the local apmc or mandi the way we call it and still make money this particular farm that we are standing in is an attempt to find an answer to that question this is a very low cost structure as compared to a fully climate controlled high tech poly house this farm is basically a insect net house if you look at the farm the walls of this farm are not made of polythene they are made of a net which has very fine mesh to ensure that a particular kind of insect which can impact the crops do not get in the second difference is the roof of this poly house is flat instead of the curved roof which is there in case of a poly house this insect net house has a flat roof which means it cannot provide protection against rain so during rainy season it's very difficult to grow crops here but if you take the rainy season out like in this particular geography the rainy season is for 3 months if we choose not to grow during those 3 months then we can still grow crops for the balance 9 months and we can do that at a very low cost this kind of setup does not need a very high amount of technology now what we are doing in this farm is now we are trying to grow cucumbers and see if we can make money by growing cucumbers in this kind of a setup for growing cucumbers or vining crop there are typically two kind of choices or design systems that can be used one is a recirculatory system called dutch bucket we will show that to you in a separate video the other one is a coco pit based system now coco pit based system is a low cost system initial setup cost is low though you need to replace it every couple of years and within coco pit based system there are two different kind of systems you can use for what we have done in this farm what we have done in this farm is that we have set up the both kind of coco pit based systems here to see which one works better and which one gives better returns this one that you are seeing is called a grow slab system you can see we are growing cucumbers here and there are cucumbers which are growing this is harvest ready side by side we are also growing cucumbers in a grow bag so that was a slab system this is a bag system and again you can see there are multiple cucumbers here which are harvest ready now now which one of these system is better a grow slab or a grow bag if one would like to compare it's quite evident and visible that the height of plant in the grow bag system whether you look here or here is much higher much better as compared to the height of plant in the grow slab system but does that definitely mean that a grow bag system is better than grow slab we cannot say for sure because the criteria which matters most is not the height of the plant but the yield and we still have two more months of yield two more months of cucumbers to harvest after which we'll be able to know for sure that which of these systems is giving the better amount of yield when fed with the same nutrition for the same irrigation cycle and following the same kind of environment and once we have the answer we will use that answer to help our client choose the right kind of system and make maximum amount of profit which is possible for them